And joining us live now is Michael Osiello. He's senior writer for TV Guide. Good morning, Michael. Good morning. Wow. Uh, <laughs> why, why did this touch such a nerve, do you think? Well, I think people are not used to seeing such unpredictable television. You know, right. we're so used to sort of everything being so prepared and so rehearsed scripted. that every day on The View you tune in and you never knew what was going to happen. And some people did wonder whether this was scripted, whether they rehearsed the fight. You don't think so? That's ridiculous. I mean, if you look at Elizabeth and uh, Rosie's face during that argument, there were really hurt feelings there. There was no way that this was uh, prepared. They were debating Iraq, and I wonder if that's part of it, too, because, you know, people around their, their living rooms and around their kitchen tables are debating Iraq. Do you think right. that's part of why we all latched on to this? Definitely. I think you either, t you know, you're on Rosie's side, you're on Elizabeth's side. You know, we did a poll on TV Guide, and it's really split down the middle. You either, you either love Rosie or you love Elizabeth, and it really polarizes people. Wow. The View's ratings we mentioned, yeah. up 8 18%. Yeah. I mean, this has been very good for The View as a television show. Definitely. So, so where do they go from here? Yeah, I mean, Rosie? it's a big challenge now filling filling her shoes. I mean, whether you can fill her shoes, but the fact is, the, the View has been on top of its game, better ratings than ever. So, Barbara Walters really needs to step up and find someone who's going to be a suitable replacement for her. But Any it's ideas? Be tough. Well, I, I we're hearing that Whoopi Goldberg is maybe the front runner. Really? Oh, I hadn't heard that. Yeah, one. we're hearing Whoopi. Um, personally, I think they should go with Gail King. Who's Oprah's best friend? Right. Who I think is a great personality and kind friend of unpredictable. Friend of Good Morning America. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see. And a couple other comedians they've mentioned. Megan uh, Mullally was one person they, they've added around. Kathy, Kathy Griffin, Griffin yeah. would be fun. You need someone in there who's going to be unpredictable and who's not going to be afraid to speak her mind. What do you think Rosie does now? Uh, I think Rosie maybe takes a little bit of a break. I wouldn't be surprised in a year, year's time she comes back with her own show. Uh, she's a hot commodity, even though she kind of went down in flames on The View this time. I mean, it really was a bad way to go out. You know, everybody wants a piece of her. All right. Michael Asiello, I know we'll keep talking about it. Thank <laughs> you so much. You bet. Will you still watch the TV show? You can tell us at our website. That's abcnews.com. Bill.